let's talk about reaffirmation agreements and credit reporting. Well, first, let's define what a reaffirmation agreement is. Reaffirmation agreements are things that you enter into during a bankruptcy process. Meaning, you know, when you go through bankruptcy, you're trying to get your debts erased, whether it be through Chapter 7 or Chapter 13 somehow. And a reaffirmation agreement is one you enter into with one of your existing creditors that you have before the bankruptcy and you say, you know what, I want to take this account and move it off to the side and not include it in the bankruptcy process. And what that means is you will remain obligated to pay on that account. Now, this can be kind of tricky and it can be an involved process, so I'm going to assume that if that's where you're at and you're considering this, that you've already talked about, your, about this type of process with your attorney. I suggest you have a detailed discussion, make sure you understand exactly how it works. Now, assuming you've done that, how does a reaffirmation agreement, what does that have to do with credit reporting? Well, pretty simple. If you're still making payments on that account in the wake of a bankruptcy, those payments should be recorded on your credit report. And when you realize that on-time payments or continual payments to one of your accounts, that's going to pass the, or cast a positive reflection on your credit report. So in the wake of a bankruptcy, a reaffirmation agreement can help your credit look a little better than if you didn't have one. But be sure you know what they mean, what they are, because once the bankruptcy has been completed, there's no way you can go back and put that account back on the, uh, the bankruptcy process. Make sure you ask your attorney about the reaffirmation agreement. You fully understand what your obligations will be after the bankruptcy. And even ask him what you should do to make sure that the payments made towards that account will help your credit report. Your attorney is the one you should talk about, but now at least you, you should talk about this with, but now at least you know what you should, you should discuss with them.